Uh, hello, everyone. I'm going to demonstrate the setup and the pipeline that I have mentioned in the article. So here is my Spinnaker deployed. And uh, here is the, the cluster group or the pods currently that is running in the cluster. You can see one pod is running. And if we access it using our load balancer endpoint, uh, the page looks like something like this. And you can see current 1.2 version is up and running. I'll just go, here's my other code repo, the GitHub repository for this uh, application or the web page. So I'll just go ahead and try to make some changes here to demonstrate the pipeline. So. I'll just change the version 1.2 to 1.3 and commit the change. So as soon as I commit the change, you should be able to see a pipeline getting triggered. As you can see here, the Spinnaker pipeline has been triggered, which, uh, you know, it is running a Jenkins job. If I go to my Jenkins, the Jenkins job has successfully, you know, triggered here. Yeah, I can see it is cloned the repo build the emails testing phase is running and then it will just finally push the emails to ECR. Yeah. So my Jenkins job has successfully run. It should be green. Yeah, and the deploy job has started. So if we go to my cluster group now, you can see a new version 13 has come up. So it is still uh, in progress. The deployment is still in progress. So once the deployment is done, you should be able to see new parts running. The deployed the new version has been deployed successfully now the destroy server group is running so you can see if we rephrase the space the version 12 would be destroyed and the version 3 will be will be the version that will be running now in some time Yeah, the version 12 has been destroyed successfully. So we should be able to see the new version up and running once the stage is complete. Yeah, so the complete pipeline has com successfully completed. Let us go ahead and try to refresh this page. Yeah, so we can see the updated code. I know the pods running with updated code. So we have successfully deployed our 
new code using the automated pipeline uh, from Spinnaker. Thank you.